I would take you with me outside for doing my autumn wreath on CBR. Uh, so yeah, I'm currently reading a few other things as well, uh, but I'm hoping to finish them up before uh, the weekend starts, so we'll see. Uh, but the two things that I'm currently reading um, that does not have anything to do with Autumn Readathon is um, Nevermore by Jessica Townsend, which is a middle grade book that has been really popular since it came out. Um, and I'm, I'm quite far into that, so hopefully I can finish that off soon. And I'm also currently reading a Swedish book uh, called Willful Disregard in the English. Uh, the English translation is Willful Disregard by Lena Andersson. So for the Autumn Readathon, I'm really hoping to read The Woman in White for a spooky book or a gothic book uh, because I really wanted to read that for October and I'm trying to sort of squeeze it in into the month, although I don't think I will be able to finish it before the end of the month. For a historical fiction novel, I'm really hoping to read uh, The Silent Companions by Laura Purcell. Silent Companions, uh, which I have out from the library. Um, and it was one of my anticipated books of last year, and I really want to get to that, uh, as well as her new book, The Corset. Uh, this is a historical fiction novel that I think is set in the Victorian era. Um, which seems appropriate for October. I think it's about a haunted house uh, or haunted dolls in the house or something like that. So it fits with the spooky theme as well, I think. For the autumnal nonfiction, I am reading Wild Nature, One with Kindness, uh, which is actually a Victorian nonfiction book, um, all about nature, obviously. Uh, and it's really charming. It's, it's much more nature writing than it is um, natural history about her pets, uh, pet animals, and how to treat them. Yeah, it's very, very charming. Uh, so I've, I've started reading that for October and I'm planning to read that for the Autumn Readathon as well. And lastly, for the cold location challenge, I have, haven't quite decided which one to go, go with. Uh, so I'm thinking either I may be some time, which is a nonfiction book about Antarctic exploration or Arctic exploration. Um, I always get those two mixed. Um, anyway, pole expeditions uh, is the target, is the theme of that book. Uh, a nonfiction book that I actually quite recently bought. Or I might read The Valley at the Center of the World, which is a book I also very recently bought. Um, and that I actually got, uh, I bought it because of Mercedes um, Book review of it of that book so i will link that in the description uh, yeah so those are the books that i'm hoping to read for the autumn readathon who knows if i'll actually end up finishing anything because i have quite a lot of school work to do so i hope you're having a really good day let me know if you're planning to participate in the autumn readathon and i will talk to you soon bye